Something strange is happening with this colony. What are these doing outside the nest? Hmm. Stay tuned and we'll investigate. So I came home and I saw these uh, pupae, larvae in the uh, outworld, my Campanotus concebrinus colony, and I'm not sure what they're doing there. They seem to be intact and everything, so I decided I'd just get one and put it back here in the tubing that leads into the nest for this colony, just to see what they might do about it. You can see they've gathered a few of them and put them a little bit closer to the exit of the nest or entry to the nest here. Here we can see a worker just sort of investigating, but not too worried about it. Hmm. So here we see another one in the outworld. There are only two at the time. And as I looked around the outworld, I just saw there's nothing strange going on out there. See their food on the nest, a couple of workers just out and about. So nothing too strange going out there, just don't know why they decided to put it outside. So here's an overview we can see of the nest. Um, you'll see in other videos um, a close up and a bit more detail of this nest if you're interested, have a look at my other videos. But here you can see plenty of brood ready to go. Now because it's winter here in Australia they're a bit dormant. Um, so they're not really developing at the moment, but I thought it was very strange to see them put into the outworld like this. Couldn't understand why. It didn't look like they died or anything like that. Hmm. What do you guys think? I'd love to hear your comments. Well, let's see what they actually did. Here we can see a worker um, just trying to get hold of it and bring it back. Sort of just dragging a little bit, dragging a little bit inside that nest. I wonder what their thought process is. Leave a comment uh, below guys if you've got any thoughts on this. And uh, while you're watching this, um, I'd love it if you guys would hit the subscribe button to the channel. Any comments, thumbs up, I'd really appreciate it guys. Thanks very much for your support. I think you'll be interested to see what happens in the end here though. So stay tuned and we'll cover this. In a little more detail. Okay, let's have a little bit of a closer look. You can see here the worker has uh, grabbed it and looks to be trying to drag it back into the nest. They're very careful as they work, all these workers when they're transporting around the brood. Here we go, let's see if we can get a little bit better detail on here for you guys so you can see the transfer taking place. These are a beautiful ant to watch. So I'll just reposition myself around here a little bit, get the lighting right. I didn't have time to set up all the cameras and lighting for you guys. Uh, this was just happening and I wanted to make sure I captured it. So you could see a little bit inside the nest and things that do happen, even strange behavior like this one. So we can see here the workers, a couple of them there are working together to bring this inside. Let's just watch this for a little bit. Okay, so they've brought it inside. We can just see a worker here just cleaning, cleaning her legs. And uh, there it is, just brought inside. Looks perfectly fine in good condition. And the worker here just uh, checking it out as well. Looks to be doing just a little bit of cleaning there 
um, on this pupa as well. So interesting, brought it inside in the end. So there mustn't have been anything particularly wrong with it. Yeah, what do you guys think? I'd love to hear your comments uh, down below. If you've come across this before in any of your species of ants. Very strange. You can see one here on the uh, left of the screen as well. I don't know if that one's ready to be put outside or what is a little bit different about these ones. Either way, a little bit of cleaning going on here. So there we go, there's a little bit of the overview of what actually happened. Now, believe it or not, I uh, left it, uh, left them alone for a little bit just to see what would happen. They actually ended up putting the pub that uh, larvae back outside uh, the nest as well, um, with a couple more. So interesting uh, to see. I left it at that. Um, I left them alone uh, for the evening just to see what would actually transpire over the next uh, little while, see if something changed. And guess what? It did. It did change. Now here they're a little bit uh, hectic as I uh, let the light in, but they actually collected all of those uh, brood that they'd put outside and they brought them all back in. You can see them here, all here um, sort of stuffed in the corners next to the uh, entrance. So I'm not sure what's going on there. But over the next few days, there was no more activity about putting that brood outside. So very interesting indeed to watch. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that. A little bit of a different sort of video, but a strange behavior there. Thanks very much uh, for watching if you've uh, sticked around this long. Again, I'd love to hear if you've uh, got any comments below what might have been happening there. And if you um, haven't subscribed to the channel, please do so. Please give the videos a thumbs up if you liked it as well. Uh, love your support, guys. And remember, happy ant keeping.